Hello my lovelies, welcome to my channel. Here we are doing the middle of the month love reading for all zodiac signs. This is going to be for Virgo, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Before we get into your reading, Virgo, I want to give you guys a quick update. Uh, it has come to our attention that we have a lot of, you know, charlatanes on Facebook, on Instagram, here on YouTube, pretending to be me and um, basically getting payment for readings that are never going to be given. Uh, so I would highly encourage you guys to go to my main page here on YouTube to look at my social media links. Those are the official links for my social medias. Anything outside of that, we are not affiliated with them. Um, my advice to all of you guys, if you come across those or if you get any type of friend request and it has my picture on it, uh, my advice is to report those uh, accounts so that they can be deleted. Um, the same thing, I've been noticing a lot of spammers coming on here on my channel, commenting or trying to lure people to contact through WhatsApp or I don't know what other freaking apps. My advice is report those comments so that they can be deleted. I was thinking of um, completely removing the comment section only because they are just a pest to deal with. Um, but I feel that it's doing you guys a disservice because I'm not allowing you guys to express on here. So I'm not going to be doing that. But again, like I said, if you do see those comments or if you do see um, people trying to solicit something, just report that. Um, I don't know why these people are doing that, but it's so freaking annoying. Okay, let's get into your reading. This is going to be for Virgo, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus. Spirits, what are the messages for Virgos in regards to love and romance? for the month remaining of June 2021. By the way, how are you doing, Virgo? Sorry for that long intro. I hope you guys are doing amazing. How is this uh, retrograde treating you guys? I hope it's treating you guys better than me. Um, this retrograde <laughs> with the planet alignments is really, really activating my chart. So, uh, you know, people really testing me. <laughs> All right, let's get into your reading, Virgo. Let's see what spirit has for you guys in regards to love and romance. All right, let's get into your reading. Your first card here is the Strength card, maybe dealing with a Leo energy. The Tower, oof. The Chariot. Interesting. Oh, my goodness. What the heck is going on, Virgo? Beautiful energy, by the way. Don't get scared. <laughs> Okay, so you guys have a lot of major arcanas. You actually have four major arcanas um, out of the five. So everything that's happening right now or that will be happening for you in the remaining of the month, Virgo, it is the astrological alignments that are assisting you at the present time. Um, there is a lot of transformative energy that is going on around you. Now, this feels more like outside influence. So again, um, there is a specific person that's going to be coming to you in regards to some type of help or some type of assistance. Um, it almost feels like their world is going to be falling apart around them. It could have something to do with a relationship. So if it is a friend or a relative or someone, just try to give them that emotional support. Now, when we're talking about love and romance, you have the strength card here. So I do see you guys, you know, you have gone through the ringer. You guys have, you know gone above and beyond when we're talking about relationships so try to work out relationships the person of your interest or the person you're going to be dealing with or have been dealing with is representing as the tower so this is a tower moment this is a tower connection for some of you guys you may be dealing with a cancer scorpio uh pisces pisces cancer scorpio type of energy um uh, Piscean energy, uh, Leo type of energy here. For some of you guys dealing with an earth energy as well. But what they're telling you here with the tower card, there's going to be some type of transformation that the partner or person of your interest is currently going to be going through. So it's almost like circumstances and situations are going to push you guys together. So if it was a situation where you were dealing with someone and out of nowhere, they kind of fell off or you guys pulled away or there was no communication. This person is coming back around and they are ready. They're ready to take it to the next level. They're ready to move forward. Uh, the chariot card is very quick movement. 
Um, but this is also the dynamic and the relationship. So it is signifying being able to get something off the ground that in the past it came to a halt. So again, I feel heavily for some of you guys, this could be a person if you recently broke up or there was a recent breakup, I see them coming back around and getting their shit together. This is a person that is not going to be willing to let you go so easily because they've realized their errors and their mistakes. This is coming in very quick. This is completely doing a 180. This is them bringing to you or wanting to offer you uh, the happily ever after. Now, for those of you guys that have been single for a while, this is the meeting of the minds. And I feel that you're meeting this person in the month of August. So in the month of August, there's going to be a some type of situation that arises where it puts you guys both two together. Um, for some of you guys, you can actually meet this person like in, uh, in, in, in some form of transportation. It could be like uh, in a bus. It could be in a subway. It could be in a train. Um, something that is connected with cars. Um, but I feel that this connection is going to be very transformative for your life, Virgo. Um, and again, with the death card, major tra transformation that is happening. And it's you being able to get to the point of feeling emotional fulfillment. So there is a very quick, sudden change that happens or that will be happening in this month of June where if there was a recent separation or recent breakup or a recent uh, giving each other some space, this person is going to completely transform. They are going to know your worth and they're going to be willing to put that effort to gain you back, Virgo. Don't make it easy on them. Uh, I, I feel very strongly like this is the universe um, bringing to you the person that is most ideal for you and the person that is capable of giving you that that happiness and that emotional fulfillment. It's them stepping up, and taking it to the next level. So again, very beautiful type of energy. I hope that this gives you guys some type of insight. I wish you guys the very best. Until then, we'll see each other soon. Bye.